Good morning! Welcome to Ordinary Days, where life with God is anything but ordinary. I'm Denise Larson Cooper. For the first time in its 40-year history, our gymnastics club had an athlete compete in an elite-level championship meet. This milestone was accomplished through years of dedication, not only by this gymnast and coaching staff, but also by other coaches and athletes who shared their knowledge and experience with us over the years. In other words, we didn't do this alone. As Christians, we are also surrounded by other believers who help us on the journey of faith. Some of our fellow believers are still in our lives. Others have gone on to the kingdom but their work and writings still influence us. Hebrews 12.1 refers to those who have inspired us by their faith as a great cloud of witnesses. The Christian faith is difficult to live in the world. We cannot do it alone. The Father, Son, and Spirit are always working in our lives, and God uses believers from the past and the present to enlighten us as we travel on this journey. The Bible is full of people like us who struggled to live a life of faith in this fallen world. Through scripture, the Spirit uses their experience to teach us the deeper meanings of God. Martyrs, pastors, and theologians have also shared their wisdom of and insight into God. Through their stories, we are encouraged and strengthened to, as Paul writes, press on toward the goal to win the prize for which God has called me heavenward in Jesus Christ. Philippians 3.14 Let's pray. Father, thank you for reliable witnesses who encourage us to stay strong in faith in Jesus Christ. Amen. Thanks for listening. Have a great day.